Vegas 2009 reporting live from the Atomic booth. What do we got here? So this is the new Ben Chetler. It's a co-model for Chris Ben Chetler. Nice. Uh, obviously one of our A-last team riders. Uh, designed his own ski, a lot of new stuff from Atomic this year. Real athlete-driven products, being innovators again in kind of the big map of free ski scene. So, um, What's well, Chris think of these things? I loves them. They're sick. Nice. I'm super stoked. Would I ski like him if I had them? Oh, absolutely. <laughs> really durable on your foot. Um, but you're eliminating chipping and cracking up on the shovel. Lighter swing weight, a little lower profile. Um, really cool thing about the ski is as soon as the rocker starts in the product, um, you go to the side cut and you've got the camber on the skis. So right. Ski That's a hot thing for next year, eh? Yeah, it's sweet. You know, you finally getting skis like these that perform well on all conditions and become a lot more versatile for all kinds of different skis. Nice. So you can uh, shred it on the hard pack and the pow. Uh, yeah, you know, nice and surfy. <laughs> you got to get back to the chair somehow. No, for sure. <laughs> you know, with a 19 meter radius, this thing's going to be pretty versatile. You stand in the middle of the ski, and it'll ski like a ski. You know, nice. this is good as anything can at 120 underfoot. Yeah, no doubt. That looks cool. What else you got in the fat realm? Go to 110 underfoot. Really lightweight. Um, really versatile. Kind of more of an all mountain dual rockered ski with. A lot of the same technology, step down sidewall, rocker, pop rocker, we actually call it a pop rocker. Oh, nice. So you got a little, a little spring underfoot. That was called the blog? The blog, oh, yeah. Nice, cool. Pop rocker. Yeah. Well, and we're getting a little skinnier, there's a bit more kind of uh, skinnier, all mountain free riders. Transitioning more into the, more of the true freestyle ski, symmetrical twin tips. Um, this is the patent, so now we have a true twin at 95 millimeters underfoot. Uh, 19 meter radius, really playful, lightweight, same step down sidewall technology uh, for the guys sending it in the park or all mountain wanting something just with a little bit wider footprint. Cool. Uh, brings us into our true competition oriented Jossie and Byron Wells, Andreas Hotbeat, um, really driving this product for us. It's uh, 82 millimeters underfoot. Um, true competition, X Games Kyle, slope and, and, and pipe nice. ski. All right, we're looking for the fattest ski Atomic's got, I think. What do we got here? This is the Atlas, so a whole new premise from us. Again, kind of bringing some of the elements from free ski, bringing it into something that we can send our boys to AK on to go charge. Um, step down sidewall. Again, camber, after the, the widest part of the ski is where the rocker starts. Right. After that, you get, into cam you get camber underneath the foot. You get a little bit more side cut underneath the foot. The mounting position set back for straight line and going fast. But something real versatile if you need to make quick turns, ski more technical. It's not as planky as some of our skis have been in the past. A little more shape with straight side cut transition and the tapered shovel makes the ski really, really versatile. What's that graphic? Some kind of swamp thing attacking wood? Yeah, I mean, they try to bring it, you know, Atlas means a lot of different things to different people. Oh, it's like contour different lines contour and stuff. Contour lines, um, really kind of showing off the mountain and the heritage of where we're sending this thing. Cool. How fat did you say these things were? 125. 125, so kind of like the Ben Chetler? Yeah, like the Ben Chetler, a little bit wider. A quite a bit straighter side cut. This has what we call power rocker. So power rocker. Full full camber underneath the foot, all the way to the tail, squared off tail, rocker and the shovel only, again starting from the widest part of the ski going forward. Would you call power rocker a technical term? Uh, absolutely. <laughs> Speaking of power rocker, uh, your voice is about as rough as mine. What's the story there? <laughs> a lot of going on. Snoop that. Yeah. Snoop dog last night. Snoop dog in um, Vegas. the night before. Nice. Um, free skier parties, all kinds of stuff going on in Vegas this year. Excellent. Cool. Sounds like Tomic's having a good time. Having a blast. There's so much to talk about this year. and having all these products really being legit and athlete driven now, um, I think we're on the move for sure. Awesome, thanks a lot for your time. No problem. <laughs>